Pharmaceutical ads. These advertisements are killing me. Night after night. The drug companies own the airwaves and it just isn't right. What happened to Marlboro when we'd see a little smoke? Now they're urging us to give our loved one a little poke. We're supposed to be ready no matter the time of day. When that special look happens, there is nothing you need to say. The men look a little older than the women that they show, but both get that look that says, hey baby, let's give it a go. I miss the Marlboro man and that rugged look he had. I heard he died of cancer. Now that, my friend, is just so sad. So it was true about the dangers which smoking could bring about. Now the tactics have changed. Much shiftier, there's no doubt. They tell us we can have it all with this beautiful woman we see. They urge to get moving and to be all that we can be. Sex in the morning or afternoon. We'll be ready any time, no matter what age we are. We'll still be in our sexual prime. Then the disclaimers come with a speed that's hard to understand. They ramble about erections or a rash that wasn't planned. Call a doctor immediately if your erection lasts too long. <laughs> At my age, I'd call a reporter and maybe put on a sexy thong. The ads must be working or they wouldn't be running every day. And thank God for the remote, so I don't need to listen to what they say. It would be quite interesting to know how many doctors are called to kill that perpetual erection. But trust me, I won't be appalled. I'm Bud DeRimer.